Dickinson University in Hackensack, New Jersey. After winning two of three on the road, the Knights are back home and try to even up their season series against the Sacred Heart Pioneers live on NEC Front Row. This should get some early baskets. They'll be in good shape this, tonight. Jenkins back to Morgan. This time he fires a three and connects. Noah Morgan, four three-point shots, three by Bishop and Holloway. Now driving the scoop, Sean Owen. Deep into the paint. FDU big guys are shooting jump shots. If they go downstairs, they're going to be up. Okay. uses a screen up top. Lopez, elbow jumper, can't get the bank to go. Flying across his little rows, back out. Three is good for Owen. He stepped right in. Ball, boy, a rainbow by Robinson into the hands of Morgan. Ahead it goes for Holloway. In one motion, catches and puts it in. Down low, Holloway. Double team comes, nowhere to go with it. Jump pass to Jenkins. Driving, floats one up and good. The ball has got to move. It looked like a screen and roll previously, except Bishop didn't roll. This time, the pretty feed and one. Tries to shake Morgan off, and off Robinson. Natasevich, corner, open look, three is good for LaRose. I'll tell you, I was assistant coach at the University of Delaware when Brashear was a player at Drexel. With one second to go, Jenkins banks in the three. Are you allowed two bank shot threes in the same game? The scoring battle. Nice D by Bishop. Watson has to pass it back out. Matasevich has a shot block. Regathers and able to bank it home. Driving. Bishop seals him off. No one gets it back. Bishop sticks with him. Nine on the shot clock. Now Matasevich. Lopez with the flush. And that has been time and time again. Edge. Watson. Driving edge, a little scoop, and Ornell edge. We'll throw it back out, Morgan. Thought about a three. Driving, he throws it down. 10 point lead, and then gave up a bunch of layups to Lopez down low. Was it just a breakdown of defense? Yeah, lo loose balls. You know, we got to clean up a little bit. Uh, they, they did a good job of just, you know, beating us 50 50 ball. So we, we got to get our hands on it and. and control possession earlier on those situations. Are you, are you happy with your offensive possession? Seems like late last few possessions really not able to get on the same page. Yeah, you know, 50-50, early good. We were running, getting clean, easy looks, and, and then later in a half, not as much. So, no, we, we had to move the ball a little bit better, a little just crisper, more efficiently, get the ball moving side to side a little bit better, not dribbling as much. Uh, we're getting good shots, but – it's at one aspect of the game, one point in the game, we were getting really good shots. So we got to get back to that. pushing the ball. You know, it all starts guarding, getting stops, rebounds, pushing before they set up. Gotcha. Thank you so much, Coach. No, thank you. And FDU. Jenkins around the screen. Lopez gets it back. We'll go against Holloway. Bangs in. He floats it up. He got jump. He fell right into their lap, and he's paying dividends as a freshman. Dickel Jenkins doing his patented thing with the steal. Jenkins able to steal it away, accelerate before Owen. Trying to knock it away. Jenkins, crossover, shovels it off to Edge. Got to look inside to Holloway. Noah Morgan once again, catching fire, steps into the three. Sealed off, cornered, gets over to Lopez. Up top, LaRose, catching fire, three from the wing is good. In rhythm. Williams will get it back, ball fake, driving baseline, nowhere to go. Morgan catching fire. Gets it, the three ball by Noah Morgan again. I think he picks it up. Uh, he has been doing it all in this second half. Zip pass inside LaRose. Excuse me, they playing not to lose instead of playing to win. You can tell in the offense, we've seen it every game. So he's going to have to make the correct pass out of the double team. With three, two on the shot clock. Edge high off the plexi. And make sure you get it to your right guys. Edge finds Jenkins, Bishop, one dribble, throws it down! No! Posterized! Congratulations on the win. It seemed like you had four or five guys play 35, 40 minutes. They looked spent completely. And then that coming out of that four-minute mark, they came out with the same amount of energy that really propelled you guys yeah. to the win. We're still learning how to finish games. And <laughs> we didn't finish it up in Bridgeport or wherever that school is. But, you know, my guys just... It's weird. It's, it feels like it's November because this team is so new since Darian's got out. Um, they're just getting better every day, and they're believing. And how about Noah, man? I'm just the kid is just his ability to step into the three, and he's so consistent doing it. He gave me that jolt of energy. Then he took the, he took the forty footer, and he thought I was gonna holler at him, and I just told him, "I, I love you." <laughs> that's that's what the great ones do when you get it. And I'm a I'm a coach, and the players. Can never get mad at me. I might get on them, but I'm pushing them to 
to be better. And, and Here's the question that i like to ask you is, you have five guys, six guys that really played a bulk of the minutes. Are you going to try and extend the bench out, especially as you wind down the season? I'm going to play you? whoever's helping us. <laughs> the other day, Mike Schroback made a three at, at uh, Robert Morris. Um, you know, whatever can get whatever, you. Whatever, you know, today we shortened the bench a little bit. But I just think they're a really good rebounding team, and they're a good team. And they, they don't, you know, I don't know if they've got three wins in the conference, but they're much better. They beat St. Francis of Brooklyn by 40 at Brooklyn. So they're potent. We respect them. And it's the first time we beat them in five outings. But my team is playing really good and hard. And you got to come to practice every day to see there's a reason why. And, and it's, it's, all, it's all about the kids. Congrats on the win. Good luck against Wacker. Thanks, sir. And so FDU comes away with the 77-67 win. We'll go through.